For the next one, we're going to do the exact same thing. Here's negative 4, so we did the left-hand side. Now let's do the right-hand side. What is a number that is really, really close to negative 4, but from the right? Well, that was what we just did. From the right. Well, positive would be over here. All right, from the right, so think about it. Negative 3, negative 3.5. Right, I know, I know, I know, it's tricky. Negative 3.5, negative 3.999, I heard somebody say. So let's plug that in. X approaches negative 4 from the right. Let's do 3.999. Now again, I actually don't, oh, that's negatives, aren't they? Now again, I don't care what the value is, OK? And you could have done 3.9 or 3.99. Doesn't really matter what your number is. Because we don't care what exactly the value is. We just really want to know, is it going to be positive or is it going to be negative? So if you add negative 3.9999, add it to 4, you're going to get a positive or a negative value? Positive. And then if you have negative 3.999 to positive 1, what are you going to get? Negative. Guys, a negative divided by a positive is? Negative. negative. So therefore, it's going to go to negative infinity. Okay. So now, let's just go and take a look at 